Are you grooms ready to look your best? Raymond from Sir Mezer is here to teach us all about suits. Raymond, thank you for being here. My pleasure, thanks for having me. Now when we think about suits, there's always a tradition to it. Talk to me about that. Well, traditionally, you would think of a wedding as a very formal affair. And what guys think of the most is a black tuxedo. Now, if you're going very ultra formal with a black tuxedo, usually you have a one button or a black satin shawl lapel, which can be very, very flattering if that's the sort of vibe you're going for. Mm -hmm. But a lot of people forget that a wedding is a celebration. So if you can avoid black, I would definitely recommend color blues, grays, even a burgundy can actually add a really nice vibrancy. But if you must go black, I would have to say, try out a midnight blue tuxedo. From a distance, it actually appears that it's black, but it's much better for somebody's complexion. At Sir Mezer, you give a VIP suit fitting experience, don't you? Yes, we do. Uh, we have seven locations across Canada, three in Quebec, three in Ontario, and one in BC. And we actually do an after-hours party for the groom and the groomsmen. It's kind of a great way for them to have a guy's night together. They can bring in a few beverages, get measured up, uh, choose some of the fabrics, and really have a really nice night together before the, uh, before the wedding. But also, we've started something new for 2018 where we offer on-the-road business services. And when they can't come to us, we'll be happily to send a mobile tailor to them. They can have a nice little gathering in their own residence, and we do the same thing and offer the same service or experience. Experience. Wonderful, so they can either come to you or you can have the party at their house. That's right, yeah, anywhere that they want to have fun. What do you and your team members take into consideration when you're helping them narrow down their look? Well, we, at Sermister, we like to offer what we call the Sermister experience. And really part of that experience is our style consultant's expertise. We have over 8,000 fabrics, which can be quite overwhelming mm. for somebody. So what we like to do first is take a fabric and really compare it to their contrast, or what most people know as complexion. We really take into account uh, their skin complexion, their hair color, and their eye color to choose a blue that's maybe best for them, or maybe a red that's best for them, in order to make sure that they look great from head to toe. In terms of the other customizations, you really have your full options. If you can find it on the internet, we can basically make it for you. So you said you have 8,000 choices of fabric? Yes, 8,000 fabrics, an abundance of fabrics, really at your disposal. It's not just fabric they have to choose from, it's other accessories and buttons, isn't it? Yeah, everything that we can in terms of making you proportion. If you are a little bit slimmer, we maybe want to give you a wider lapel to broaden your shoulders. Um, maybe you want to go for a little bit formal, so we give you more of a one button instead of a two button, or the traditional three, button, three on roll button that I have on my jacket here. In terms of the sleeve buttons, even in terms of the customized linings that you can get, have, get crazy on the inside and have a little bit of more of a personality. How often would you say that the bride is involved? Does she show up with a picture and ask him to get the same? Well, often um, a lot of people would think that a bride is in total control of the wedding, but we found that recently men love to be in control of their look. So yes, they will be come, coming with a photo sometimes to show us their vision, but guys also have a vision of what they want. And I think that's one of the great things about Sermister. They come in and we really bring that vision to life. So they can have their own vision, but they also want it to mesh with what the bride and the bridesmaids are wearing. Yes, so that's the main advantage of having over 8,000 fabrics. Really, if you bring in a swatch of what your bridesmaids are wearing, we can match it with the suits. But another subtle way to do it and have a guy still have his own voice and have his own perspective is to allow them to choose the colors that they want. And then we match the accessories, such as the pocket square or the cuff links that can be custom done as well, or even the buttons to match what the bridesmaids have. Oh my gosh, options, that's wonderful. Options are totally on the table for everybody as long as you have the willingness and the bravery to follow through with them. I know that some women we don't like to wear the same dress over and over. Is that the same for a suit? The suit definitely gets worn over and over again by men, especially if they choose one of the colors that can be blue, gray, or even a brown suit. The great thing about the suit is its versatility. If you want to change up the look of the outfit, a blue suit with a pink shirt gives off a totally different vibe than a blue, shirt, a blue suit with a plaid shirt, mm. or even a gray suit with a lavender shirt. And then you have so many mix and match options, including ties, darker ties for more formal occasions, or floral ties for more of a spring party. So you definitely get more value out of the suit if you go with something classic. Definitely, just play it up with all the accessories. For sure. We would hope that a groom, we would want a groom to invest in a new suit for his big day, but fashion comes and goes. If someone already has a suit, how long is it good for? 
Well, actually, the current incarnation of the suit has been around since about the 1930s. And I think it's proven over time that it's actually one of the most flattering aspects of a garment that a man can wear, in, including first impressions. So a suit is definitely something that's in a wardrobe that can last as a staple and as a classic going forward. In terms of the modern suit, it is not necessarily about the styling of the suit. It is actually about the measurements and the cut. So we have several gentlemen who are maybe a little bit older that want something more functional, a little loose, maybe something that is more akin to the 80s that come in and get suits with us. And then we have the gentlemen that like to have something a lot skinnier and maybe have a hard time trouble sitting down, but looks great on the wedding day. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. You also told me that if they have a suit and the body does change, you can fix that for them. One of the main components of made to measure, or one of the caveats I should say, is that the gentlemen have to keep their shape. But this being made to measure and we realize that life happens and maybe guys get a little happy over time, <laughs> we build in about 1.5 to 2 inches into the seams, which usually means that you can go up or down about 10 to 12 pounds. So you plan ahead for them to have this suit for a long time. Of course, we want to make sure that when they choose the best fabric for them, it has the durability, longevity, and the uh, look of a classic man throughout any era. Having seven locations across Canada, what feedback have you received from customers? I think the, the main feedback that we've received is that they're sad that they didn't find us sooner. The, the reason is a lot of gentlemen, they don't like shopping. And this totally puts the shopping experience in the mall on its head. You, instead of going to the mall and going through racks and racks of clothing of things that you potentially don't even like or wouldn't even buy, this is something that's completely made for you. Now, when you go to the shopping experience at Sermister, all you have to do is pick a fabric, say, that's what I want, and it comes completely made for you and fits perfectly. And you said once they get their measurements, you keep that, don't you? That's right. A lot of our customers are repeat customers online. So once their fit is perfected, then all they have to do is go online they can pick a fabric that they see as a picture rendering and they can order it straight to their house. Unless they want to have another party and have everybody over. Of course, we always welcome to come into the store, feel the fabric, it's always nice to have that experience. What other misconceptions are there about choosing a suit? Well, I think um, one of the misconceptions about a custom suit is that everything needs to feel tight. You can actually have a very slim look and still have functionality. There is a nice middle ground that you can have in that. And also as well, a lot of people are focused on the look of the suit. We really want to focus on the fabric that is best for you to bring eyes up to the communication zone and focus on your face. You are really the guy that should be looking good. It shouldn't be nice suit, it should be you look great. And so when we pick that out, we want to make sure that you walk away feeling confident wherever you go. Well, Raymond, thank you for coming in the studio. Thank you for both of you being here. I learned a lot today about suits. Thank you for having me. Ray brought in two looks today, but if you want to see the abundance of choices that they have, go to the show.